Hey guys, it's Dirty Dungeon here, back with another episode of Conquest of Elysium 4, Demonologist Edition. I would have this episode out to you sooner, but I recorded an entire hour, I didn't save it all, and then it crashed. So, we are back where we were uh, on the last episode, I believe, unless I'm mistaken. Either way, we're sitting right here. Uh... We, I believe this unit was either recruited or I recruited it, um, last episode, or this, right before this episode I may have done it, can't really remember, either way, we're gonna go right back into it, and play some more Conquest of Elysium, or, and I don't see much we can do this turn, so we're just gonna end it, and, now, so I do know what's happening this turn, essentially, and what'll ha probably happen the next few turns if the AI decides to do the same exact moves. Uh, however, I will try my best not to take advantage of that. I, I will tell you, I'm gonna fight that right there. And, uh, what else we're gonna, what else should we do? Definitely go away from that. Let's go reconquer these mines. And then go to this ancient forest after probably retaking that tent village. Um, we're not going to engage them. We will keep uh, meteor showers on as they come by us. Because that is essentially our suicide technique where this guy will be the only one alive. Because he has the uncanny ability of regeneration. Which is pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, that's, these are some powerful spells. We might send him to the Inferno one day because he has that regeneration. Uh... He can only, believe, I believe, have the spell that uh, allows for him to go in, not come back out. So he'd be in there permanently if we sent him there. And uh, this battle is going to go pretty well, probably. Cast some spells, turn the sound up a little bit. Fireballs. I love how all these long deads spawn in the beginning. I think it's kind of cool. Yes, but I always save with this game. It has some uh, strange tendencies to crash depending on certain battles and other things. I suppose. But this battle is definitely going to go well for us. Ooh, did we just lose a troop? I think we just lost one of our regenerators. Or a long dead. If it was just long dead, I don't care. But if it was one of our... Uh, we couldn't have lost one of these guys, could we? I mean, it's possible they did like a hell of damage to him killed him, but I doubt it. These dudes are pretty strong. The spearmen can definitely die. Those guys are weak. But our blood sworn are strong troops. Backed up by all our casters in the back lines. I did, which I'm kind of disappointed in that it actually now didn't happen in our uh Let's play, play through, whatever you want to call it. We got Demonic Locust, which I showed off in the video. And they're pretty cool. Uh, they have this weird fear ability, which makes troops like these guys really easy to uh, get running back to their respective homes, making them flee in terror. Oh, and we just lost our Hellhound there. I feel like I'm losing more troops than I did the time before when I fought these guys. That's a little disappointing. Definitely feels like it. Because we got our heroes in the front line with our succubus and other stuff like that. Whew. He's got a wraith crown and a demon whip. That guy should be fine. I wish I had spine devils in this army. Spine devils are faster, I believe. Or at least they seem faster. No, they are definitely faster. They run to the front. And they... I believe they rank in the front where these, uh... Stronger demons don't. I don't know. The, the uh... Probably best optimized army would have, like, a line of spine devils then these guys, the blood sworn behind them. And probably some... Casting devils. Man, I'm still upset about this succubus. It's been it's been a while, but that was a really crappy summoning to get to finally control one of the demon lieutenants and it ends up being a succubus. 
one of the crappier ones. She doesn't do much. Really not much at all. It's very disappointing. If we had needed just a commander, it would have been fine, but we needed more than And this battle's over. I think oh. Okay, I think one of our guys did die. Who died? Someone with a Wraith Crown? I'm surprised if it someone did die with a Wraith Crown. Might have lost one of our blood sworn there somehow. Let's see. Who grabbed that Wraith Crown? You have the Demon Whip. You don't need that. Give it to this guy. Who grabbed the Wraith Crown? So it wasn't you. So one of our blood sworn must have died. But who got it? I'm not seeing it. Did you get it? You got it. Okay, we don't want it on you. We'll put it on him again. With the Demon Whip, he'll, he should be rather unstoppable. That being said, move this way. Some centaurs guiding this mine. Or sorry, some centrides as well. Can't forget about those dolls. Um, Let's go for 50, maybe? We want to do that? Let's, let's do it. Let's do a greater demon summoning. Oh, and we got two hellhounds to replace the two we've lost. How wonderful. And how fitting. Uh, nothing really to do there. Move to this mine. Move to the tent village and then up to the ancient forest to reclaim it. What do we want to do with you? We'll probably just do an imp summoning at 10. Why not? And we got a shitty imp messenger. Ugh. That's no good. Ooh. The trolls are fighting, uh, I believe that was the, uh, yeah, these guys, the uh, dryads. Which I believe they killed them. Yep. Yes, they did. Let's move between commanders. Nothing to do there. Let's just retake this village. Why not? I don't see a reason not to. To the next. Uh, let's let's take the gold stream. Why not? And we'll recruit in celebration that guy and some swordsmen. Back at the huge cave we're trying to build an army at. Oh, and we charmed a uh, centaur. It's got some XP with it, too. Nice little addition. I don't believe it'll die. Because uh, it's got a lot of friends by it. Yeah, we just gained a centaur. That's cool. It's got a longbow and a hoof. Uh, should be nice. What? Where does it rank? It ranks in the mid. So it'll be in the middle section of our army. Not too shabby, if I say so myself. The dragon continues to roam throughout our land. Hopefully it'll eventually roam into the dryads area. Oh no. This is not a fun a fun army. I don't like this. Amulet of anti magic. What do you have? You have a slash resistance? Jesus, that's a lot of shitty troops, but a lot of good ones right in the front. Magic flowers. Yeah, I don't really want to fight that, but we're kind of stuck here. Ooh. Hopefully they don't kill us. Got a storm demon. That's always cool. So we have 122. They have 400, uh, 411. We have a really good front line, but I don't know if that would save us. Long deads. This guy would come in handy up here, hopefully. Uh, nah, he's got shit. Shit, uh... We don't need fire resistance for that battle. Let's keep this one up. Let's take that one down, actually. Why not? Yeah, we don't have a lot of men. That's a scary prospect of losing those guys. Okay, they haven't fought them yet. They would lose massive numbers if they did fight us, because... You know what? We'd probably win it, just because these guys are all vulnerable to fire. Yeah. As long as the spells hit true. And all these guys will die very easily. Even their, uh... Shaman is vulnerable to fire. That's something. With that, let's move this way. 48 goblins and a couple trolls. Probably take them out, but we want to keep on the move, hopefully. 
Recruit some imps. Let's see what we get. We got some fiery imps. It's one of the better summons we could have got. Let's move there. Nothing really to do here. Let's see if we can go retake that cave sneaky. Sneak alike. Ooh. They retook those. Not gonna go save them yet. Let's transfer this guy under him. And we could attempt something risky. Let's let's try it. Of course, no. Hopefully it doesn't kill anybody. It's gonna kill the swordsman. And yeah. He lost the swordsman. Oh well. Oh well. And we didn't recruit there that turn. Probably should have, since we have that gold stream. But I forgot, so that'll be that. Holy shit. Why? We keep running into these giant stacks. What is what is even what is this even? What is going on here? This is just a clusterfuck of wolves. <laughs> Lee, Lee, I like to think this is their commander. <laughs> the rabbit familiar. Oh boy. This is the real commander. With a morning star flames. It's not super, super good. It's pretty strong. They got a lot of meese, and I don't, I don't like that one bit. Is there anyone else we want to move? Let's move him there. And you can scout out a little bit. Oh, there they are. Nope. <gasps> We've been attacked. Oh, shit. Okay, uh, this is bad. Not gonna lie. Hopefully we win. I don't think our prospects are good, considering these guys are gonna destroy our front line. God, this didn't happen in the last, the last one. We didn't run this way, and we didn't die like this if we do die. Not doing enough. Oh, the line. This guy's already almost dead. He's got one of our flaming swords. The mooses are dying pretty... Or sorry, the meese are dying pretty well, but... I don't know. Can we last this long? We have a regenerated line. These guys are already burning somehow. Centaur is enraged. We're definitely going to take some losses, I believe. It's going to be dangerous for us. God, you're almost dead. I strongly dislike this fight. Got those hellhounds, but they're in the back. That's not where we need them. They got pushed back, I think. Got to get real lucky if we're going to even do well in this. God, all those mooses, the meeses are coming for us. Doing some damage down here. One of them's fleeing. That's good for us. Just, yeah, he's panicked. Does that mean they'll run through their lines? I don't know how that works. I'd hope so. Still got our flaming sword, dude. He needs to regenerate some HP. Uh, a bear killed one of our guys, I think. God. Kill this guy! Oh, boy. Did we lose a devil? I don't think we did. Come on, boys. I believe in us. Some of them are... I think this one's panicked. It's gone berserk, though. That's no good. Once we get past all these bears, I feel a little safer. Jesus, that's a lot. Could lose Damon. Our brave man who's been here for a while. Our faction leader. He's still sticking around. Oh, nope. <laughs> I shouldn't even said that. Just cast our own spells on him. Killed him. Boy, these bone fiends are sucking up as much health as they can. Damn, our line's destroyed. What are you doing? Why? Don't do that. 
I know there's probably like an enemy spawning back here, but you can't do that. It's bad. And he's all the way in the... Oh, God, our heroes. Some of our magic item people are way in the back. What do you even have? You have the Robe of Shadows or your Ether Roll. It's not horrible. Our air elemental is doing well. This bear's on fire. We just need to panic him like that and get him running. It's going to be a long fight, guys. It'll be a big victory for us, at least. It doesn't really help us, even though, is the thing. This one was looking for more territory, not to just kill people. I think I'm about to be eerily disappointed with the results of this. I don't want to let it skip ahead. Man, we just... Oh, God, these guys are all going to get angry and get more HP, aren't they? Does their magic resistance go down when they go berserk? No. Damn. Real shame. Come on, guys. I know we can do it. We even have this little imp out in the front. <laughs> he can't do much, but at least he's there. What is happening? Is this... I'm confused. What is summoning the... Is this... How can this summon those? I don't understand that. But boy... I'm... Oh, it's the, st it's the storm. Yeah. It's got summon clouds. So we could make it out of this. Because I don't know if the AI factors in those spawning. And it also couldn't see some of our units that were ethereal, I believe, or invisible. If we have any invisible ones. I think they can see ethereal ones. Maybe not if they don't have spirit sight or whatever it is. Ooh, that was brutal. You need to not be in the front. Then again, we don't have much of a front anymore. That is beautiful. I like all these clouds they're summoning. That's good for us. A lot of soulless back here. Those being spawned? Might just be being spawned. As long as our faction leader lives, we can rebuild. And some of our men, you know. Like, I'd like to keep our devils for the most part if we could. Okay, we're about to make it through the bears. This hellhound's in the front, and someone gave him ethereal. Ethereal? Ethereal? I don't know who did it, but. I am thankful to whoever did it. That is not one of his natural traits. Might have been a shadow imp. I don't know if these f disease demons could cast anything like that. But it should help him a little bit. He might die still. Come on, blood sworn. Charge forward into the abyss. Should have gave uh, the flaming sword to this guy. He's definitely living longer than the one who... I don't believe had any protection besides the sword. He was just a regular blood sworn. Diseasing them is definitely going to help. Yep. Kills their strength. Mm hmm. Yes, sir. Oh, that lightning is always a nice thing to see. Coming from our clouds. Doesn't do a bunch, but it. How much does it do? Stuns. It can stun. Yeah, it doesn't do much damage at all. Alright, we'll continue with the, the fight. The fight for our lives. Get to fight through all of this. And then f somehow kill him too. Those gauntlets of power would be nice, and so would that Morning Star of Flames. If we can get to him. Which our chances aren't looking horrible anymore. We've at least cut through the main part of their first uh, first kind of powerhouse of troops right there. The mooses and the, the bears. The truth is the demon faction is pretty strong when it comes to troops. You don't need a lot, a lot. Because these guys can summon those bears really rapidly. The druids take off and so do the... Uh, uh, the dryads. Because they have regular monthly spawning troops as well. Like, the, these guys 
Um, I'm not sure if they have to summon the boars with the dryads, but I know for sure that these guys spawn monthly if they have a captain in their base. So do the harpies and the minotaurs and the centaurs. Uh, they have a like increased spawn rate for some of them. For example, this one. Yeah. So basically, it just spawns them. Dude, if oh, it's a good fight so far. My fears of losing are a lot less as we start beginning to work on the boars. Oh god, he took a wound. Finally, our ethereal uh, shadow cloaked blood sworn is taking hits. Somehow this dude's oh yeah, he's ethereal, that's why he's still alive. <gasps> oh those oh, who's doing that? Whoever's doing that pain. I think it's you. I think lashes of pain is hurting people, or this agony. Either way, it just killed our blood sword with the shadow cloak. It's causing some issues to our troops. Now we have a one of theirs with a demon whip. I doubt he'll do much, but in fact, I don't know why I gave him the demon whip. Or even if I did. If I did, that's my mistake. She should not have that. Ooh, our storm demon's taking some hits. I didn't see that. It's no good. Yeah, it's you at that. Those lashes of pain are not helping us. They're not my much. They've hurt us more, I believe. Come on, shoot flames, little pups. I wish our hero wasn't all the way in the back. Yeah, he'd be nice to have in the front. Lashes of pain going out again. Looks like we keep gaining more and more clouds. We're not going to do very well right next to him, though. This elemental is going to be helping us a lot. And here come two of our devils in the front with some Harley Quins behind them. We're working our way through, that's for sure. Once we get to here, I know we're we're okay for the most part, because these guys will go down pretty easily. Unless he has some crazy... He has Clouds of Confusion and Summon Wolves. He has some pretty high magic-resistant units. I don't know how well he'll do. The Summon Wolves thing I'm not very thrilled about. He's probably been casting that already. Just summoning more wolves. But... Hey, it's just... It's not really any concerning um, factor due to the already massive amount of units they have, unless we get down to a couple men. We have a lot of solace, which is what I'm worried about. I'm seeing a lot of not good troops left. They've worked through most of our blood sworn, or pushed them, a couple of them to the back. Like one of our more useful ones with the Wraith Crown was pushed to the back. Exposing some of our better units. Whew, okay. I'd rather not lose the Storm Demon. Or is it a Storm Devil? It's a Storm Demon. Oh boy. Yeah, some of the factions aren't as balanced as you can see. They have overwhelming odds, but yet they're not defeating us. Uh, they also don't have very good troops. Uh, and they don't have a lot of casters. They just they have a massive amount of troops, so that's more of their issue. But still, this seems somewhat imbalanced that we're taking out their entire army with uh, not even a... I don't even know. Math-wise, they had about 400 or so. We had 120, I think, 120 something, somewhere around there. But uh, either way, we don't even have half their numbers, and we're kicking their butts. That was pretty brutal. Succubus is on fire. It's no good. She's carrying our magic lamp.
looks like our guy with the demon whip has gone berserk. He probably won't last too long. He was not built to fight in the front. More of these uh, undead pop up, these soulless. Uh, I'm okay with that. Seems to be a lot of them everywhere. What is hitting us with fire here? <gasps> you. Well, that would be nice to have if we can kill them all. He's dead now, so we don't have to worry about the staff of fire anymore. Yeah, that is definitely an issue. But we'll definitely put that on one of our front guys. Or one of our probably second rows. So he can just cast it and kill people. It's pretty powerful. Oh, come on. Let's fight, boys. Just look at those logs. Lightning, lightning, lightning. I'm surprised he's still alive. I don't believe it works that way, but what if what I wonder if he would actually spawn us satyrs. That'd be crazy if he could. Because I know he can't lead, but would he work as he's intended and spawn satyrs? Because he is a captain. That'd be pretty crazy. If he lifts through this, which I doubt he will, I kind of want to try that and see how it works. I don't think it should do that. Because I believe it's limited to that faction, but what if it did? That'd be relatively cool slash insane. I don't believe it works that way, though. As we're finally getting through their serpents, it seems like. And the majority of them. We're gonna work up to their... Oh, the Grand Herephodite, or whatever it's called. The, uh, cen Centride. The femar female centaur. Oh man, Heli. This dude's been doing pretty well. Considering he is, uh, Ethereal, I'm not surprised he did better. Did you do that? It was probably a Shadow Imp. Shadow form, that's gotta be it, right? Yep. He's been casting shadow form on people. What a great shadow imp. I wish we could name them. I'd name him... Uh, Eth uh, Ethan the Shadow Imp. Because he's so good at ethereal spells. He'd be Ethan. Ethan the Shadow Imp. I can dig that. I really don't want to skip through it because I'm worried it'll auto-resolve it poorly. And we'll say we lost somehow or lost a significant more amount of troops. I don't know if it works that way or not, but... I, I, I'm too afraid to do anything else. It's always nice to get another Solus, even if it's on fire already. I really want to kill this guy before he starts casting confusion on our troops. Some of our weaker-minded friends, including these zombies, could have some issues with that. These soulless can get confused easily. He's 31 HP. With that Morningstar Flames, but if he gets involved in a melee conflict, I'd be... I'd be... Rather confused. Yeah, he's already confused one of them. Oh, one of our imps died. Poor imps. Weren't you all supposed to be in the front? You sneaky little imps. Oh, someone's probably summoning those, actually. <laughs> That's probably why they weren't in the front. Oh, and he confused all the imps. Or a couple of them. Look at all that lightning. We're gonna lose all those clouds when the battle's over, though. The Solus will stay if they've been actually turned from these troops. I do believe Heli the Hellhound be dying soon. He's only got 8 HP. Yeah. I do believe this battle is won. It's just regular imps. Are they confused? Is that why their color's different? I don't know. Kill him. Just suck the soul out of him. That, that was weird. It's probably not the best thing to say. But you did just kind of obliterate him with your uh, bolt of unlife. I don't know what else that would do besides suck the soul out of somebody. But it's rather odd to say. 
Come on, kill that centride. Before she causes more any more issues of confusion. Oh, how did you get poisoned? I just like that. You have good spells. Don't you... Do you have... Yeah, you have one tick of poison. You need to get to the back. Or kill him. Oh, man, you lost almost all your HP already. I don't like that one bit. He lost his poison, but he's right in the front. Which armor do you have? Not a lot. You just gained an HP somehow, and you're losing all of it. Oh, I just like him being there. He's a good devil, too. Oh, well. I don't know why it's not on our side yet. What is wrong with it? Slow and... F okay, what? Clumsy. This is half... Wait, do Solus miss all half of all attacks? I didn't know that. That might be new. Or since I played it. Or I have never read this before, but I didn't see that ever. Oh, please don't die. You got 5 HP. Come on, there's not many left. Oh, boy. I'm rooting for this devil right here. We've won the fight, but can we take as minimal losses as possible? You're facing rabbits, dude. They do one or two bites, and they're probably not that good at hitting. Can rabbits be clumsy? What are rabbits, tiny? Oh, you're kidding. They're just so difficult to hit. That's a little... Ugh. He's this giant demon trying to poke down like a rabbit. He's having issues with it. Come on, imps, get in front of this guy. Don't let the rabbits eat him. Like, cast his fire upon the wolves of Elysium. It's safe to say we've definitely won this one, though. Oh, will he get away with five health? I don't care if you go fight in the front. Well, okay, we won. We did lose a significant amount of troops, I believe. Oh, there we go. It's a win, and our devil lived. Yeah, we're gonna have a lot of this. Okay, we'll distribute these in a moment. Quite the fight there. We don't want to get trapped by that dude either. Move this way. Ooh, a mountain bailey. This is the perfect place to go to relax for a moment. We have 99 units. So we did lose a significant amount there. Let's distribute. You know what? The Staff of Fire, I don't think it could be on anyone better. You kind of range towards the middle, too. The Row of Shadows, however. I can go to pretty much anyone else. I'll choose you. Uh... We have Firebrand, we have the Fire Thing, we have someone with the Gauntlets of Power, there you go, okay. You don't need that. You, that'd be useful on you. I haven't seen you in the front too often. Not often enough. Could put it on you with the Demon Whip. Just give you more strength. We'll give it to him. He could use the HP. It'll add to his regenerative abilities. Did you get anything? You got a ring. You got a pendant of luck. Uh, you can just keep it. I don't care. Be honest. Who got the sword? You got the Morning Star Flames. You definitely are not keeping that. That's silly. Put on you. You have the cloak, right? Yes. Is the Morning Star. How good is the Morning Star Flames? It was one eight damage, plus two, and then one to twelve damage. It has a burst of one. You do not need a demon whip. Put that up in the front guy. Him. You got the firebrand sword. Who was it? Someone let me know. I do not see it. I know one of them. Oh, you got it. One of our cultists grabbed it. There you go. Hopefully those guys all... Sit in the front lines and murder people. It is my aspiration that they will. We will recruit more men down south. We're just going to go from next to next commanders. Nothing to do there. Uh, could I actually recruit units for you as well. Let's get you some swordsmen. 
into the, your mix of units here. Next, uh, for now, since these guys have decided to be douches and come out there, we're gonna do some summoning. Got a serpent. Probably should have summoned up to the north with Damon, but for now we'll just do that. Kind of hoping this guy stays out of our our way. What's going on here? Ooh, you have a couple. You have magic acorns and a wand of sleep. That's eh, not that great. You also have a hellhound. That's a little odd. And a bunch of infamiliars. Damn. Lot. Move you back there. And... Do we want to bother with this? Possibly. Let's try it. Got control of one frost fiend. How wonderful. Do some more recruiting. Let's do a scout. Some swordsmen. Some crossbowmen. There's carrion moving over there. We still have control of all this stuff, which is good. We have secured it permanently, it looks like. Or at least semi-permanently, as it hasn't been taken yet. Oh god, we've been ambushed by something. Hopefully nothing too dangerous. Let's kill these wolves. Oh, he's just taking everything up here, isn't he? That's a shame. Other than that, we're not going to move you much. This is not the music for a demonologist. End the turn. Oh yeah, it's a troll forest, okay. Oh, it wasn't that bad. Lost a couple. Should easily take this tree down now. Without any losses. There we go. Good game, forest. Kill these wolves. Quite easily. But we would never stand a chance against that demon army. Oh god, the trolls have taken advantage of our victory. By sending all their men back. I don't like that. You have quite a bit too. See, this is just way less threatening on the massive boulders, so we're actually kind of vulnerable in a siege. We're gonna keep moving. We're not gonna keep these for long, but it's been nice having them. Let's get a catapult here. And some spearmen here. Move him down. Oh, we could kill this traitor. You just have a crown of command, but he'll give us some resources too. So if we can catch him, we'll definitely do that. Just go to be a douche and take this back if we can. He's stuck up in that swamp with Shrek. Yeah, okay. Got a catapult. Two catapults and some men. Take this off. Because I know what you're going to do with that, and I don't like the meteor showers thing. Not cool of you. You know, really, he could probably self-sustain himself, though. That. Let's move him. Oh, we forgot some... Eh, I don't, I don't care about five of them. We'll keep this on with the expectation that we're going to lose troops of the Wazoo. But he has some good items. That make him... Very, very powerful. We'll see how he does. He doesn't have any experience, but his name is Vol. Could Vol VR a one-shot wonder who just goes conquers places, leaves troops. Just to, for, to have them, you know? He's our conqueror. He's our strong demon that we could send around. Is it him? Could be. He has some of the traits I've been looking for. Take this village. Not much else I'm looking to do this move back to our ancient forest maybe kill those serpents or we do Let's take this is that our turn you have movement where'd he go huh i don't know does he leave elysium once he reaches the other side of it i have no idea i know that we get a notification that says there's a trader moving across elysium but I don't know if that was one of those or not. A couple villages. Bad. 
Oh man, there's a lot of villages this way. Good route. Nothing so far. There he is, so we're gonna move back and take our village again. Playing a game of cat and mouse. Yeah, there's nothing there. We're gonna take that next turn. But this turn we'll do some demon summoning. Got another lesser demon. He's probably gonna die when the meteor shower's coming down upon our troops, but we'll see how that works out. I always gotta remember that these these guys are gonna spawn a bunch of troops as well. So the siege might have worked out fine. What just happened above us there? I saw something happen. I don't know how I feel about that. Oh boy, okay, there's the demonologist again. Not a cool guy. Are you sl you are slow. So this will put us actually in striking distance still. I don't like that. So we're gonna we're gonna try uh one of these guys. Oh we got another storm demon. How wonderful. Always with these storm demons we're getting. So who to move? Fight this. Let's see. Alright, what? Oh, you don't have any moves. Okay. I think that's it for this turn. So we do have a catapult as well, so this will thin their numbers. We have some flying demons. Hopefully his first move isn't to cast meteor showers. We can get through this without him murdering everyone. Okay! His first move was to kill everybody. <laughs> it's nice to see where his priorities are, murdering every single living thing. Uh, it definitely was effective against their own troops. God, it's not even like... Units Im immune to fire are still affected by that. Yeah, so that just murdered a catapult and everything else. So that guy is definitely going to be that kind of go around, murder everything. Uh, leave no prisoners kind of kind of dude. Let's see what the damages are this turn, I guess. Ooh, a city. We could definitely use this. <gasps> Mistakes were made. Hopefully we don't die here because of that action. Ugh. I didn't realize that Carrion had just taken that and these guys were converging. But the city would definitely be valuable. It's a valuable resource for the demonologist too. So I feel like his chances of attacking us are probably high. They just killed everything. Okay, we're leaving... Someone else in command. Uh, but I have to come right back.